What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Dash Reacts and today let's check out part two of South Park's Black Let's check out part two of South Park's Black Friday trilogy. This is a song of ass and fire. Let's do this. <laughs> Game of Thrones style intro too, that music. Now let me tell you, child, of a war that is about to come. <laughs> Since time unremembered, there have been two. At the dawn of war, I stand alone, looking out at what will be the last battlefield, for winter is coming. And I am a princess. So silly. And now I have chosen my side, best for all, for it has a dual shock <laughs> controller with a speaker and a touchpad interface. This voicing is great. What the hell is he wearing now? My followers, though few in number, shall help see me through until I am finally accepted as a princess by all. But even now, the enemy is training for battle, also preparing for winter. You think this is a joke? On Black Friday, there's gonna be thousands of shoppers trying to get inside that mall, keeping you from getting Xbox Ones! We survey each enemy, and we attack their weak spots. Scott Malkinson has diabetes, so we hit him in his weak spot. That's and we are not what? going to be beat by that traitor whore, Kenny. Get back to training. You know why Kenny's doing this, right? Because he wanted to be a princess, and I wouldn't let him. There's only one ruler, and that's me. Sony released the PS4s, Cartman. People are liking them. Just keep them in training, Sir Cal. Two can play at Kenny's backstabbing game. Casa Bonita. Yes, hello, I'd like to speak to the president of Xbox, please. Eric Cartman, I'm a wizard and a king. No, I'm not king of wizards, I'm a king that happens to be a wizard. Just put the CEO of Microsoft on the phone! Mr. Balmer, John and okay. Dave from marketing are here to see you. There's a king in Colorado, a young wizard who believes that Sony will have the upper hand. His followers are prepared to fight to the death over which system is better. Uh, what are you guys talking about? You sound ridiculous. There's going to be a war in this small town on Black Friday and it's all over the news. Guys, these are console wars. This one kid says that he's a wizard and that Sony is helping to guys, arm all of guys, us. Guys, guys, <laughs> It's just a video game machine. Microsoft's a company that tries to be above all the petty commercialism. A tragedy struck last night when mall security officer Miles Happy Davis Is that blood on that candy cane? Miles Happy Davis was beaten to death with this candy cane after oh. telling a mother she couldn't line up for Black Friday until Thursday night. The mall has decided to officially drop another 10% off Black Friday deals. That's not... Happy was a good man. Too good to have died in such a brutal but festive manner. Captain! <laughs> Captain! The mall is dropping the Black Friday sale another 10%. What? Oh my god. Just making it worse. Don't go out there, Randy. If you are here for Black Friday, you cannot be on mall property until midnight on Thanksgiving. Well, what if we just walk really, really slow? Uh, uh, you're gonna have to walk slower than that. You've got a while. So dumb. Paladin Butters, I was hoping I could talk to you about Lady McCormick. You mean Princess Candy, my lord? How do they deal with the Queen of Dragons in Game of Thrones? They don't! So what happens when the dragons show up? The dragons are just still on their way! They keep promising dragons, but all I get are more floppy wieners in my face! The key to our victory <laughs> is following the Game of Thrones model exactly. I want you to take Sir Scott Malkinson and go seek out George R.R. R. Martin for answers. Who's George R.R. R. Martin? He's the guy who writes Game of Thrones, Butters. He can let us both know how to handle Kenny and if we should betray Clyde or not. Interesting. This is really about you and me getting Xboxes. The rest are simply there to help us get through those doors. I told you kids to stay out of my damn yard! How come every time you talk to somebody, it's about betraying somebody else? Turns out it was nothing, just some kids trying to turn the console wars into something bigger. Yeah, well, nothing I can't handle. There might be some changes we need to make to our marketing, but I'm optimistic. Oh, no. Uh-huh. You're right, Steve. Some changes do need to be made. <laughs> Do you know what weakness is, Steve? Weakness is believing that competition is healthy. Weakness is believing that competition is healthy. When tech companies grow really, really big, they usually end up having some kind of monopoly issue down the road. I know Microsoft did. And my question to you is, which tech company do you think is the biggest monopoly right now? Let me know in the comments. It's all headed to one device that people game on, watch TV on, socialize on, 
I can't have you idiots throwing away everything I worked so hard to achieve. Clean that shit up. <laughs> Phil Gates is a G. I think my insulin is low. I need to eat. Well, let's just talk to this guy and then we can hit him at McDonald's. I'm sorry, but Mr. Martin does not see fans. We're not fans, and I'm pretty pissed off if you want to know the truth. About what? Well, let me talk to George R. R. Martin and I'll tell him about what. <laughs> Why is he saying it like that? It's the Red Wedding, isn't it? You hate how I killed everyone off. Uh, no, sir. We just really need to know about the dragons, but they never seem to show up. The dragons are on their way. Wait, please. It's urgent. There's a young blacksmith, and his wiener gently hangs down between his legs. <laughs> Soft and flaccid, his wiener glistens in the golden sunlight. No, no. Can we skip the wiener stuff and just get to the dragons? What's the matter, Scud? I told you I have to eat every two hours. He's diabetic. Why don't you kids come out of the cold? I'll order us some pizzas. Oh, okay, thanks. I'll tell you everything that's going to happen in Game of Thrones. Back to the garden. Sir Kyle, I wanted to talk to you about Stan. Stan is wrong. Princess Kinney is loved by her army, but Stan is still the nuts and balls of her operation. The nuts and balls. A huge setback to the traitors getting their PlayStations if Stan were to be... grounded? You said nobody would have to be grounded. We're not playing dirty. Did you know that Stan's dad is working a temp job as mall security? What? Stan with somebody on the inside to help him get his PS4s? Who's playing dirty now? This is all about you and me getting Xboxes. The rest are simply there to help us get through those doors. Don't believe it! He said that to a bunch of people! You're on my property! I'm calling the cops! Well, go ahead, exactly. call the fucking cops, Dad! Oh, oh. oh, it's you. Tom, I'm standing in your doorway because we have a hot news story to report. We don't go to work for another hour. Just got a call from Bill Gates. He says he can <laughs> promise us a bigger war on Black Friday if we play along. Having a bloodbath on Black Friday is good for the news. It's good for us. He can't turn it off. Our job is to report the news, not make it more violent, because you're so about integrity. Or maybe I should let everyone in the newsroom know what their two anchors are up to. Oh. It's the morning news with Tom and Tammy Thompson, Colorado's top-rated brother-sister news team. Well, <laughs> I was not ready. I was not prepared. That was such a stupid. Bill Gates himself has shown up to try to make it even bigger. Oh, That's no. Right. We've come to offer swords and battle axes, whatever the kids can carry to help them fight their way through the other shoppers. You've donated some guns to the kids as well. Yes, but we are limiting it to one per Xbox follower because, of course, the key thing here on everyone's mind is safety. What? Wow, really? Hi, is Kenny home? Uh, yeah, Kenny's out back playing with his friends. You just gotta let him let in? Go. No, you, you gotta turn me. <laughs> Protect get out of here! Get out of get out! Let them pass! <laughs> the princess bids your fat ass welcome to her kingdom and suggests you state your purpose. Look around you. Lay down your weapons, and you can come back and fight for Xboxes with us on Black Friday. <laughs> the princess says that if you want to change your mind and agree that PlayStations are better, she'll consider it. Kenny, we all understand wanting to play as the chick once in a while. Come on and touch my body. But you are never going to be a real princess. What? <laughs> the princess calls you what? a ball-licking lesbian. That is not what Lady McCormick just said. I didn't hear all of it, but I heard most of that. At the beginning, he said, oh, the nerve. I didn't get the piece in the middle. And then he said, <laughs> You are never going to be a real princess. What? <laughs> the princess calls you a ball-licking lesbian. That doesn't even make sense. Right? All these people are going to be gaming on Xbox. You really want to just game with Craig the rest of your life? I would rather game with Craig. Then spend one minute having to set up an Xbox Live account. You're outnumbered 10 to 1, and there's no time left. How will you win? The gods will find us a way. So, Vin Samuel Tarly sees the army approaching, and his wiener is about this big. How many wieners can you spot in the background, boys and girls? I count one, two, three, four wieners. Four! Uh -huh. Samuel has to rally his men. So what does he do? He takes out his wiener. And he dangles Not it around for all his men to see. Stop it. Get some help. Sure, you said peaches were coming. Yeah, yeah, they're on jail. their way. They're still coming. 
So Samwell's wiener. <laughs> but you said they were on their way like three hours ago. If I don't get pizza soon, I'm going to pass out. Pizzas are on their way. They're going to be amazing. Jon Snow finally faces Jamie Lannister, and this guy's wiener is, you know, huge. Eric, right? Uh, it's my Lord Wizard King, actually. I hope that we're clear that this is my army. There can only be one person of royalty. That's kind of the ruse. Oh, I certainly don't want to step on your toes. I'm quite good at letting my CEOs do what they want. Your CEOs? This is really just about you and me getting Xboxes. The rest are simply there to help us get through those doors. Out manipulating uh, Cartman? What? Ha ha! How's it feel? Now who's walking who through the betrayal garden? <laughs> That was amazing sex. I enjoyed it immensely. How about you? With the mic still. Tanushkatana. It was fun, wasn't it? Tanushkatana. Microsoft has given kids who want Xboxes on Black Friday a lot of support. Eh? Nani kore? Tsukareta yo. Eh? Nani kore? Tsukareta yo. There must be something you can give to kids who want Sony's to make the fight more even. Hai. Yes. Kore ga arimasu. I have this. The kanji on this box says yobi, which is day or day of the week. Yes, I think that will do nicely. I wonder what it was. Wiener, 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 next to another. Wiener party, wiener party, party party, wiener wiener's nice and soft, non erect. Wiener, flopping wieners, dangle wieners, dangle wieners in my bed. Stop, stop, please. I can't take any more. You promised that pizzas were on the way. If they don't show up right now, you're gonna have a dead kid on your hands. What kind of pizzas do you want? What kind do we want? He hasn't even ordered your pizzas yet. Not just two pizzas, there's there's gonna be five. And they're gonna be huge, you won't believe it. Come on, Scott, we're leaving. Black Friday is about to happen, and my friends and I have to be the first ones inside the ball to get Xboxes. <laughs> I just saw the little boy statue over there. How many wieners did they slip into this scene? Well, why didn't you say so? I can help with that. I'll make some calls. I know a way to make sure you're completely prepared for Black Friday. Sony PS4 no urazuke. Zenbu. Domo sumimasen. Sony PS4 no urazuke. For your support of the Sony PlayStation. Zenbu. Domo sumimasen. I could be I'm sorry for everything, or it could be thank you for everything. The president of Sony bids you thanks for all oh, your support translated. of the PS4. Sore kara. He offers you this gift to once and for all make you an official princess and to give you the powers you need to win this war on Black Friday. <laughs> Is that a Sailor Moon badge, bro? Oh, this is great. Wow. Eddie's a Japanese princess. <laughs> Full anime style. It's Tuesday. I'm gonna kill Princess Kenny. Why again? Why late? Kenny is a cute princess. She's a cute girl, isn't she? Let us face these shoppers with the bravery of those mall security officers before us. The mall has decided to push Black Friday by one week. Oh. Ah, Black Friday. Oh, on. The genius idea was proposed by George R. R. Martin, who also suggested, fuck it, let's push Thanksgiving to December 3rd. The mall is now reducing Black Friday prices to 96% off to the Ooh. first 100 people inside the mall. Big discount. This is going to be a fucking bloodbath, Tom. No doubt a lot of people you know and love are going to die. <laughs> wiener party, party party, wiener party. Wiener. That was so good. You know what kind of episodes I like, and you know I enjoyed this one because it had that Japanese crossover stuff in it. But I'm looking forward to part three. And if you enjoyed this reaction, please make sure to give this video a like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.